Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you for an album review, and this is for the Tuesday album review for 21 Pilots' album, Vessel. So I'm gonna discuss what I listened to, or what I know I've listened to, and let you know my thoughts on this record. So let's dive into this review. Now, this is their, I believe, third studio record because they made previous albums before that and they had a few members that left from the group group or whatever so it's only a two-piece band now it's only Tyler Joseph and Josh Dunn and I think they did really good on this record um there's a lot of great memorable tracks to come back to it does get very wild <laughs> and very anthemic most of the songs it makes you want to jump up and down ode to sleep just makes you want to go crazy to that song because the melody is so great that it just i just felt to me that it helped me through a rough time with some of the lyrics in there, I swear I heard demons yelling, those crazy words that they were spelling, and they told me I was gone, or whatever. I pretty much know the lyrics to it, because I've heard this album multiple times. Well, a bitch load of times. <laughs> but it's just so good. Um... Holding on to you, the next track after Ode to Sleep, which Ode to Sleep lasted for a little over five minutes. And it was a pretty impressive track. It blends with different genres. It definitely changes its tone of the song and how it's playing out. And it works very well. Um, I know I made a album review yesterday for Baby Metal's album review, Metal Resistance, and I said that it, there are certain songs that didn't work, and I was kind of right. There were, they were trying to experiment with different melodies, different soundings to their song, and it did not work with some songs. Not every song was bad, but I just couldn't get behind the fact that they tried something different, which I know different's a good thing, and they want to try what they want to do, but it did not work. Uh, but for this record, it does work with different soundings, different melody changes. And Ode to Sleep definitely brings you on a really roller coaster ride for different soundings, different melody changes. I know I'm saying the same thing, but that's what you're gonna hear when you hear this song. It goes do 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 with the start of the song. And then it goes do 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 at the I think pre chorus and building up to the next line of the verse or whatever and that actually is a better shift change with the song sorry if I talked about Ode to Sleep for a little while now to talk about the other songs the other songs Holding On To You and Migraine were fantastic I think Holding On To You is a favorite but my favorite's gotta be Car Radio and Guns For Hands those were favorites. I liked the when Tyler and Gun f Guns for Hands is singing. I'm trying, I'm trying to sleep. It it just sounds so great how he's singing it, and it flows so well. This song. Um, trees. I heard like a different audio when I first heard it, and it, it didn't sound good. But when I heard the original audio, the better sounding studio version of Trees, I really liked it. I'm like, I'm in love with this song already. <laughs> the only one I was 
at least a little disappointed with was Fake You Out. Fake You Out wasn't terrible. It just didn't pique my interest that much of being a great song. But uh, Semi-Automatic, Screen, and House of Gold are great songs. Pretty much almost all these tracks are fantastic. It takes you on a interesting ride this record and it just doesn't let go of you it just keeps you interested and that's what i love about this record it has a lot of great songs on here i just didn't think fake you out was my favorite it wasn't terrible it just wasn't their best work i know the lyrics are great in it. I like the lyrics. I just don't like how the melody is going. Because that's when they tried a little too hard with it. In my opinion. But. Car Radio's got a lot of great. Uh, I actually did a cover of that a few months ago. Or. Back in February I think. You should definitely go check that out. if When you can. I know I probably wasn't the greatest singer singing it I'm just singing it in my deep voice because I usually blow my voice out when I go to work and all that singing and it just yeah um, for me personally out of 10 I'm gonna give this a 9.5 out of 10 this is a fantastic record this is something worth purchasing this is something I definitely see replay value for because there's so many great songs on here. The video for House of Gold was very weird. Where they're split in half. Uh, Tyler and Josh. And their upper body is like... Tyler's upper body is singing. His stomach, head... And da da da. And then his legs are gone. So he doesn't have his legs. And he's just like levitating. Not levitating, but he's like uh, standing in one place like he would if he was standing. And then he falls down at the end of the video, which is pretty weird. But. Like I said, I'm giving this a 9.5 out of 10. This is an awesome record. But comment below. Let me know what you guys thought of this Tuesday album review for 21 Pilots' Vessel. If you've heard this record. And if you like this Tuesday album review, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can to support the channel. I will be returning to you. Sorry, I almost thought I was going to sneeze. Ah, I will be returning to you for uh, maybe a track review. I don't know for sure. I know Maroon 5 made their new video, Memories, which I'll definitely go check that out and maybe do a music video review for it. I'm not sure. If I do, I'll return to you, but for right now, there's not really much coming out this week. I know the new Green Day song is coming out tomorrow, so I'll be reviewing that. I think it's called Fire Ready Aim. Uh, if I'm not mistaken. If I am, just let me know. Uh, in the comments below. And, yeah. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this review. I did the best I could to make it as good as possible. Uh... I know I might have said repeated words, and I'm sorry about that. And mentioned the Baby Metal metal Resistance album not being so great. But I just couldn't get behind that record and defend it. it. There was not any redeeming qualities to that record to really enjoy. Uh, but some of the songs were not so bad. But thank you for watching this review. I know I rambled on for a little bit. 
And I'm sorry about that. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in my next review.